Hey, I just want to remind you guys, In Your Corner, a movie I directed on Floyd Mayweather and Sam Watson, is out now on vimo.com. In Your Corner, click the link in the description box. Uh, and I would genuinely love and appreciate you guys' support. And uh, don't, don't hesitate to leave a comment and let me know what you thought of the film. And uh, again, I appreciate you guys' support and enjoy the video. Peace. So, I think I figured out, I'm on my Malcolm Gladwell right now. I don't know if you guys know what Malcolm Gladwell is, but you guys got to subscribe, buy his book, Blink. Um, why am I drawing a blank on Malcolm? He's my favorite author. Uh, <laughs> oh, man, he got the 10,000 hour rule. What's the name of that? The Tipping Point. Read that book first, and then it'll open up everything else to Malcolm Gladwell. But um, I think I figured out why black people can't swim. They say black people can't swim. You guys ready for the answer? I was like, why? Home ownership. I was talking to one of my girlfriends, and uh, we, were having a, we were having dialogue. And, she, and I was like, you know, I don't know how to swim. And I didn't own a home. Uh, my mom got remarried. I didn't own a home until my sophomore year in high school. So I went my whole childhood without owning a home. And the reason why I say home ownership, because pools come with home ownership. And if you own a home, if you don't have a pool, you'll live next door to a person who have a home or have accessibility to a person with the pool. You understand what I'm saying? Whether it be sleepovers, because if you live in an apartment, you live in a concrete jungle. Even the park you go to is a concrete jungle. It has concrete, two basketball courts, a basket, a gymnasium that services everything, and this, <laughs> and it has a gate around it. And you may have a, a field where they play soccer. In LA, the Latinos play soccer, you know, and case may be. So, anyways, and she said, I don't know how to swim, but uh, I can swim underwater. And I was I said, you need to teach me how to swim. You know, I said, it's about that time. I turned 40 this year. It's about that time. I'm on, you know, finding stuff I'm not great at. You, you get to that point in your life where you just want to just do everything, right? You begin to start to count backwards instead of counting forward when you're on the verge of hitting 40. You know what I'm saying? So, anyways, I just genuinely believe I'm on my Malcolm Gladwell because you know how Malcolm Gladwell does something so small and ties it to something so big. You know, home ownership is the reason why black people don't swim. You understand what I'm saying? And you may associate that to the slave trade and slaves may not wanting to go to the water. But I think the biggest, one of the biggest issues why black people can't swim, home ownership. You live in a concrete jungle, public pools are far and in between. Uh, you don't think about pool. You know, you think about sports that, that are inexpensive, like a basketball, like a football, you know. Why don't black people play hockey? Um, Malcolm Gladwell did a study on that about birthdays between November and February, about birthdays and how it allows you to become a great athlete because of uh, you can either wait to go to kindergarten as a five-year-old going to six or a four-year-old going to five, you know what I mean? And that one extra year, will allow your body to develop much faster and further than a guy than a kid like me who graduated at 17 from high school. So, with all that being said, I genuinely believe that is a big reason why one of the biggest reasons why uh black people can't swim home ownership. You know what I'm saying? So, uh let me know what you guys think. Um it was just a, a thought I had. You know what I mean? I was doing some deductive reasoning because she owns a home and I own many properties, and um, I'm in. Es I was telling I'm in escrow right now on another apartment building, and we we're just talking about home ownership, and it just it just literally clicked, literally just clicked in my head. That's the reason why black people can't swim. So let me know what you guys think. It's an interesting concept, you know. I I, I don't know if there's any analysis or data that can substantiate my claim. But the reason why black, I, this is the reason why black people can't swim, home ownership. And then you can also say the slave trade happened on the Eastern Peninsula. You only get six months out the year to swim per se, you know, if it's outdoors, you know, so the other six months you're inside, it's cold. So just, I, there's so many different attributes that you can equate this to, but 
Home ownership is one of the reasons I genuinely believe today why black people don't know how to swim. So anyways, man, barbershop conversation. And it may even be a myth, you know? You know, so. Anyways, man, barbershop conversations. Feel free to subscribe button. Talk to you guys soon. Peace.